go change this model and hopefully this here will make it change colour. I will let you know how it goes. In your plop. It looks like some of the paint is getting a bit bubbly and sort of things. The base was green, it's now gone a bit of a greyish sort of colour. And yeah, hopefully I should be able to just scrape that off with a toothbrush. Uh, I'm going to give it another 20 minutes and then take it out. So after one hour, I've managed to, with a toothbrush, get the most of it off. I used a pair of tongs because I don't actually have any plastic gloves at the moment. But yeah, like so, I turn it over. As you can see, where the paint was laid on a bit thicker, it's still there. And let the greens come off the base, but I think, yeah, leaving it in a little bit longer, it'll probably stay that way. After two hours in the liquid and then scrubbing with a toothbrush and a cocktail stick, I've managed to get it to a point where the model itself is pretty much completely clean. Like, uh, yeah, like you're sure you can see a bit of paint in like the recesses, you know, and like sort of underneath it in certain places. There's nothing stopping you repainting that. We're just respraying over it because all the details are now no longer obscured and you could probably get some pretty good decent coverage out of it i'm gonna probably leave it for another hour or so but i guess we'll see this green bit of paint doesn't want to shift off the uh the base though even though the whole base was green earlier and now it's like you know it's like a normal base again so i'm probably just going to soak it for one more hour see how it goes and then show you my results. And this is what it looks like after I covered it in methylated spirits. It took me about three hours, but with a, you know, and yes, there's still little bits on it, but that's good enough to respray and put back on the tabletop.